Hello guys, this is Jahad Ahmed and I'm here with my new videos. Um, I was busy in my work, I was busy in my studies, so I have not uploaded any video uh, from long, long time. So, yeah, I'm, I'm here and I'm gonna uh, give you solutions to problems. Um, so the problem which I found uh, with some people is uh, how you can allocate extra extra size to your partitions. It's really simple. Uh, you don't have to install the whole Windows again. Um, it's like a headache for uh, those guys who don't know this method. So it's the only way uh, you can extend the uh, extend the partition. So if you see my drive, his C drive, it's, it has free space of 4.60 GB and um, 62 GB of total space. And if you see on D drive, it has 632 GB of total size and 338 of free space. So I can use this space. And give it to C drive. How I can do it? I can do it using Mini Tool Partition Wizard Home Edition. Um, it's pretty easy. Uh, you can download this tool from the link below. I've given the link below, and you can download from there and install it. Pretty simple installation, like how many other softwares. Uh, then click on uh, this tool and click OK. After it, uh, as you can see, that I can see. Uh, dialog box and okay I can see a C drive with the capacity used and unused space and also I can see D drive these are not for uh, it's like recovery data uh, recovery uh, drive so I don't use it I'm gonna extend this C drive uh, and I allocated 10 GB more okay so I'm gonna right click on it and click on extend and as you can see that our dialog box is appeared in here so it says um, give and take whatever you want uh, adequate space to your drive so I'm gonna take free space from a G drive which is my miscellaneous drive it has 632 GB of total space not free space so in, in the below here you can see the new size of 65 GB of C drive will, will become 221 GB so I don't want it to be 22 and 21 GB. I want, I want to allocate it 10 GB of, uh, of data, 10.707 GB. So it will become 75.28 GB and new, drive, new size of G drive will become uh, 622 GB. So it's okay for me, okay. And just click on OK and that's it. Uh, as you can see that capacity is now increased and unused space is now 14 GB. If we refresh the page, you can see there is no changes because we haven't we haven't applied it yet. So we have to apply it. It will take a few, uh, few minutes. Uh, I can uh, recommend uh, you if you back up your data. Uh, it's, it's a security case. Um, I'm not gonna take any responsibility if it damages your data however i have tested it on my computer so i'll uh, i can show you it will do nothing to your uh, data okay so i'm gonna pause the video and I mean, i'm gonna click on apply i'm gonna pause the video and after that i'll uh, show you what happened okay okay guys uh, I'm, I'm here again and uh, as you can see that uh, apply all pending changes successfully okay so now it's done and click on OK and you can see that there is no change here but you can see the change here. Just refresh the page and you will see the change. Now it's 14 GB of 75 GB uh, remaining. So it's it's really awesome to and let in within less than 20 to 25 minutes or it depends on your size of your disk uh, and it takes time but it's it works time. It was your time, and that's it, guys. If you have any questions uh, and if you have any problem, please feel free to ask. Just write the comment on uh, in the video's description. Sorry, in the video on the video, and um, don't forget to subscribe. Thank you, guys.